for me to leave for me to have left rather i mean it, it was uh it has uh, gotten to to my to to the point i couldn't just bear it anymore and I, I i was treated like i'm just a nobody that's just how i'll put it you know it was welcome back as the news broke of TLC's plans for an explosive reunion special featuring Angela Deem and Michael Ilizami, fans of 90 Day Fiancé found themselves divided. The internet buzzed with anticipation and speculation ran wild. This could be the last time the controversial couple would face each other on screen, and the stakes were higher than ever. For some, it was the ultimate opportunity to witness the dramatic conclusion to their tumultuous relationship. It's never been this bad. What the heck is never wrong with her? Ever, ever been this crazy. Well, is it because Michael's here in person? Yeah, I'm not. I have had my problems with Gina, but this is this is humiliation. Yeah, that's a little bit crossing the line. Yeah. Why are you shouting? I, cause I pay taxes, mother. Sam, yeah. you ain't paid, bitch. She's gonna give herself a heart attack. Listen, I don't care who you talk to. Why don't you ever pay attention to your wife? I'm playing with a good-looking man, I, um, another good-looking man, and you don't even give a smile, mother. Keep smiling, you fraudulent mother I'm the dumb one, because you know what I told my kid? You know what I told my girls? All women are dumb in their house. You don't listen to a goddamn thing. Nobody told me anything. Sh shut up. Nobody told me anything. I got the dumbest, smartest husband in the world. To be honest, I was, I was scared. I said my Get was so your Get out of my house. This is my house. My house. For others, the prospect of seeing Michael subjected to Angela's torment once more was a cause for concern. From the moment Angela and Michael appeared on 90 Day Fiancé, their relationship was defined by a series of intense power struggles. Angela, with her fiery temper and domineering personality, often took control, leaving Michael to navigate the complexities of their relationship from a position of weakness. Their dynamic became a focal point of the show, drawing viewers in with each new conflict. Over time, Michael's attempts to assert himself were met with resistance from Angela, who seemed determined to maintain her hold over him. The couple's journey was marked by explosive arguments, shocking revelations, and moments of genuine affection that left fans questioning whether their love could withstand the pressures of their differences. As the years passed, Angela and Michael's story became one of the most talked about on 90 Day Fiancé. TLC, ever the master of turning drama into ratings gold, saw an opportunity to cash in on the unresolved tension between the two. The network's decision to bring them together for one final reunion was not made lightly. This was a high-risk, high-reward move that could potentially break the internet and draw in millions of viewers. The plan was simple, capitalize on the unresolved issues between Angela and Michael, reignite old flames, and watch as the drama unfolded in real time. But there was one major obstacle standing in the way of TLC's vision, Michael's refusal to participate unless Angela was somehow tamed or restricted in the way she treated him. For Michael, this reunion was more than just another episode of reality TV. It was a crossroads. After years of enduring Angela's outbursts and manipulations, he had finally started to see a way out. He was determined to move on with his life, to find happiness and stability away from the chaos that had defined his relationship with Angela. But the lure of fame and the potential financial windfall that came with it was hard to resist. Michael knew that appearing on the reunion special could boost his profile and open up new opportunities. Yet, the thought of being under Angela's thumb once more was almost unbearable. Michael found himself torn between two powerful forces, the desire for freedom and the allure of fame. His refusal to participate unless Angela was held in check was a desperate attempt to reclaim some control over his life. But even as he made this demand, he knew that the network might not be willing to accommodate his wishes. TLC thrived on chaos, and a tamed, Angela might not provide the drama they needed. For Angela, the reunion was an opportunity to assert her dominance once more. She had always thrived on being in control, and the prospect of facing Michael in a public setting where she could manipulate the narrative was tantalizing. Angela was no stranger to the tactics of reality TV. She knew how to create drama, how to play the victim, and how to turn the tables on anyone who dared to challenge her. But there was more at stake for Angela than just maintaining her hold over Michael. The reunion represented a chance to solidify her legacy on the show, to go out with a bang that would leave viewers talking for years to come. Angela knew that this could be her last big moment in the spotlight, and she was determined to make it count. Yet, even as she prepared to confront Michael, Angela was aware that the tides had shifted. Michael was no longer the submissive partner he once was. He had grown stronger, 
more determined, and less willing to put up with her antics. This newfound confidence in Michael was both a challenge and a threat to Angela's sense of control. As the day of the reunion approached, tensions ran high. The internet was abuzz with speculation about what would happen when Angela and Michael came face to face for the first time in months. Would they reconcile? Would the reunion devolve into chaos? Or would Michael finally stand up to Angela and walk away for good? TLC spared no expense in building up the anticipation. Trailers teased explosive confrontations, tears, and shocking revelations. The network knew that this reunion could be the biggest event in 90-day fiancé history, and they were determined to make it unforgettable. When the moment finally arrived, millions of viewers tuned in to watch the drama unfold. Angela and Michael entered the room, their faces a mixture of determination and apprehension. The atmosphere was electric, charged with the weight of their shared history and the unresolved tension that still lingered between them. As the cameras rolled, Angela wasted no time in trying to reassert her control over Michael. She hurled accusations, dredged up old grievances, and attempted to paint herself as the victim of their relationship. But Michael, to the surprise of many, did not back down. He stood his ground, calmly countering Angela's claims and refusing to be drawn into her web of manipulation. The power dynamics that had once defined their relationship were shifting before the viewer's eyes. Michael was no longer the passive partner, and Angela found herself struggling to maintain her grip on the situation. The tension in the room was palpable, and it became clear that this reunion was not going to go the way either of them had expected. As the reunion special came to a close, it was clear that this encounter had marked a turning point in Angela and Michael's relationship. The power struggle that had once been so central to their dynamic was no longer as one-sided as it had been. Michael's newfound strength and determination had shifted the balance, leaving Angela to grapple with the reality that she could no longer control him as she once had. For the viewers, the reunion was a spectacle of raw emotion, manipulation, and unexpected resilience. It was a reminder of the complexities of relationships, especially those that play out under the harsh glare of reality TV cameras. The internet buzzed with reactions, debates, and memes as fans dissected every moment of the encounter. But for Angela and Michael, the reunion was more than just entertainment, it was a moment of reckoning. Michael's refusal to be drawn back into the toxic cycle of their relationship was a powerful statement of his desire to move on, to reclaim his life and his future. And for Angela, the realization that she could no longer dominate him was a sobering reminder that her control had limits. As the dust settled from the reunion, questions remained about what the future held for Angela and Michael. Would this be the end of their story? Or would the unresolved tension between them continue to play out in new and unexpected ways? For TLC, the reunion special had been a resounding success, drawing in massive ratings and generating endless buzz. But the network was left with a dilemma, how to continue capitalizing on the drama without pushing Michael too far. There were already rumors of new spin-offs, featuring Michael navigating life post-Angela and Angela grappling with her loss of control. For Angela, the future was uncertain. She had built her persona on being a dominant force, but with Michael's departure, she would need to find a new way to stay relevant. Whether that meant finding a new partner to control or reinventing herself entirely remained to be seen. Michael, on the other hand, had finally taken a step towards freedom. The reunion had been a test of his resolve, and he had passed with flying colors. But the road ahead was still fraught with challenges. Breaking free from Angela's influence would not be easy, and the allure of fame and financial gain would continue to tempt him. As the saga of Angela and Michael on 90 Day Fiancé appeared to be drawing to a close, fans were left to wonder if this truly was the final chapter. The reunion had been a powerful and emotional conclusion to their story, but in the world of reality TV, nothing is ever truly over. TLC would undoubtedly find ways to keep the drama alive, whether through new spin-offs, surprise appearances, or even a potential reconciliation down the line. For Angela and Michael, the reunion had been a turning point, but their journey was far from over. In the end, the shocking reunion had done exactly what TLC had hoped, it had broken the internet, captivated audiences, and left everyone hungry for more. And for Angela and Michael, the impact of that encounter would reverberate long after the cameras stopped rolling, shaping their futures in ways they could never have imagined. Thank you for watching.